Well, hey, hi. It is, uh, my goodness, what time is it? It is, I believe, 11 o'clock here in Cal uh, Washington. 11.13. Wow. Hey, Jake. Jake Mackesy, how are you doing? I, it's, uh, I, I, hey, Jake, are you coming to Emerald City? Uh, it, it's, um, I know you're in Portland, right? But aren't you like, I hope you're coming down. Um, yeah, I'm in Seattle, Jake. You gotta come, you gotta come over. You gotta come down. We have to, uh, you and Beth come down. Let's do, um, we'll meet, uh, Brian Lenz and, um, uh, go have dinner. Anyway, uh, hi everybody. Thanks for joining me. I am know it's late. Uh, no, buddy. Oh, I'm sorry that your dog's sick, dude. Um, I'm going to miss you, Jake. I wish you guys could come down. Yeah, I'll, I'll give you a call. T I'll call you tonight. You're, you seem you're still up. Um, here, I'll call you after the webcast. But we're going to do a drawing lesson right now. It's really late. Um, I had an amazing, amazing day. you got to read my post tonight. It was hilarious. Oh, my gosh. I did, uh, I'm did. i doing two panels every day. I, I love Read Pop. Uh, these conventions in the USA and overseas uh, Read Pop Comic Cons are the the ones that uh, they're they're the ones who invited me to go to Mumbai and New Delhi Comic Con and, and uh, Paris and Birmingham uh, and um, and Vienna just uh, and then C two E two in Chicago and uh, here in Emerald City, Seattle, the New York City Comic Con just uh, Gary and uh, Mike Negan and. Christopher and Katie, thank you so much for all your hard work here domestically. And oh my goodness, it's just a, a, a blast. I'm, I'm definitely in my happy place when I'm teaching here at these Comic Cons. But today at 4.15, I'm gonna tell you, you gotta read my post because I, everything that could go wrong went wrong and it was still an amazing experience and everybody had a wonderful time drawing. But it was, it was madness. Oh my gosh. I get there. I I forgot that it takes 20, 25 minutes just to get down the escalator. There's so many people to get from the sixth floor down and across the street and over then up an elevator to the, it, it, it's so huge, just Emerald City Comic Con. And I didn't give myself enough time. So for a 415 panel, I got there at 410 and I like to give myself at least 20 minutes for, so I was trying to, oh, hey, Scott, how you doing? Um, yeah, I'm just having fun. I know. I Yeah, I, I, I need to rest, but I'm, I'm feeling great. Um, so I get there and everything that could go wrong. You got to read my post tonight about it. It was fun, but it was definitely reminding me how much I just love teaching. I was in my happy place. And so let's draw together tonight. Let's go for our, our 90 days drawing. Um, I tried. I was going to go today. I, I did two panels today and it was just the panels were so, the workshops were so busy and I was going to go live so I wouldn't have to go live tonight, right? Do two birds kind of thing, right? And uh, I'm going to do 90, but I couldn't go live because I was so busy uh, working with the kids and the parents and all the attendees. It was so fun. But it, meant, it means that I get to draw live with you guys. All right, I'm going to draw. I'm going to draw a really funky uh, 90 days here. And then look at I'm going to put a line, and I'm going to have a sign up here. And this will be for the days, right? We'll do what uh, um, uh, Chad Wheeler always does. This he puts days over here. I like how I pick up so many things from what you guys do. Karen Wall, I do pick up things from what she does, and Lisa Wiling, and Dace uh, Inin from uh, uh, Norwich Days. I pick up great ideas from your drawings. Everybody's drawings. Thank you so much for sending me the drawings. I pick up such great things. Uh, last year, I did work either of the panel I attended. Ha! Uh, well, hopefully I pulled it off then too, okay? So now here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna fill this up, but I wanna draw 90 days, 90 drawings. Uh, what day, how many days is this? Who, who can help me? Karen, I'm looking at Karen. Karen's always good. Uh, hey, look at that. There's uh, there's Vanessa Gillis from Portland. There's John James. Hi, John James. How are you? How many days is this? Day what? Days or day 97, blah, blah, blah. You brought so much. Oh, 
Scott, well, thank you. Thanks, Scott. It was so much fun. Oh, my gosh. I love my job. I'm so, so lucky, you guys. Here, come on down here. What we're going to do is we're going to draw a cliff. Uh, and 74, thank you, Karen. Karen Wall, she is our official 90-day project manager. You should see these incredible indexes she puts together for me for reference. Bless you, Karen. You are so awesome. Karen, are you drawing yet? I know you took a break from drawing for a while. I'm glad you're here hanging out with us and getting our creative uh, energy. Day 74. I don't like how that's working there. I'm going to think of something clever there. I'm not sure, but we know it's day 74. I'll I'll figure something to put right there. I'll figure it out. See that? Now i got to draw something over there. All right, I'm going to draw the cliff. Curve it. This is called contour. Put a dot out here. I'm going to put a layer. Now, let's, let's, let me just show you something over here. Put two dots just for a second. I'm going to show you something. Put two dots, draw a four short and circle. And then draw down. We're gonna, now watch this. Just draw down. Now watch this. What, what we're going to do? Curve the bottom. Put a dot here and a dot here. We're just going to do a little side jump. Hi, Brian Salinas. Brian, do you, you never sleep. Brian Salinas, Mr. Workout King. He's inspiring me. He's losing so much weight working out, getting his life super healthy. Brian, you work out guru, man. I am so proud of you. I'm inspired by you. Curve the bottom. Good job. Uh, draw a clever... Oh, ha! There it is. I'm at table N in 16. Scott, you are so funny. All right, I'm going to do it. I'm going to put another sign here. And this sign is going to be... I'm at table... I keep on forgetting what table I'm at at uh, Emerald City. So that's table N N. 16. All right. And then 16. All right. So you know what we did here? You guys see this? I'm going to do, I'm practicing right now. Look at this. Come in here. Draw the, see that foreshortened shape? We're going to practice this ledge. See this ledge right here? This ledge is what we're going to draw on the other side, but we're going to have a dinosaur tail coming out of it. And this is from one of my curve the bottom. This is contour. Okay. And then, uh, see what we're doing here? Do you, are you with me? Are you with me? Are you with me? Someone give me a heart. Give me a... Give, I know the light's kind of funky here. I'm using the hotel light here, but it's the best we can do right now. So I'm going to go around. Look at a four short and circle. Go stretch out. Come back in close. And we're going to learn. We're going to use this edge again. I just want to practice this edge. Curve the bottom. And then right here. Now watch this. Let's... let's uh, now watch what I'm gonna do here. I'm gonna. Well, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? I'm gonna draw. Let's draw the window to practice. The window's on the right side, so put thickness on the right side. Okay. And up here, let's put a window on the left side. We're gonna be practicing ledges and thicknesses. The window's on the left side. So draw the thickness on the left side and the bottom. Okay. That's cool, right? All right. So let's take what we learned there. And let's apply it. Let's come over here, and we're going to draw this really cool edge, and I'm going to put a, a big a doorway, all right? This will be kind of cool. This will be look like the, uh, this is a little, kind of a take on this, my new book cover, okay? Kind of a take on the the doorway, but we're going to make a, a, a door in the side of a, a cliff and have a dra uh, dinosaur's tail coming out. Now, remember, you guys, if you want to get my new book, Please uh, pre-order it. Go to go to my website, which is markkistler.com right there, and click order new book, pre-order new book, and please order my new book. This is how um, I'm uh, funding a lot of my efforts with the Mark Kistler Imagination Initiative. And I'm so excited to tell you that uh, all the proceeds from the Comic Cons I'll be going to today or this this weekend, next weekend, and for the foreseeable future, uh, the proceeds are going to the through the Mark Kistler Imagination Station to help fund our effort to inspire and invigorate and educate and promote the visual arts with with minds around the world, and that's with these live feeds, these webcasts, with school assemblies, child 
hospital visits, uh, shelter visits, and of course, summer art camps. So thanks. You can pre-order my book, okay, guys? You get a digital version. You can get a copy of the book. You can get an autographed copy of the book, or you can get an autographed copy with an original drawing sketch inside. I usually just sell the sketch for $2.99, but you can get a book with me drawing an original sketch inside for only $99. Bucks. How's that? So I hope you pre-order it and it'll deliver hopefully around October. So get it, get it now. Now I'm not going to leave that sketch option open for for a very, very, very many. I'm going to limit it. I'm not sure how many, but get it while you can. It's a wonderful way to get a cool original commission from me. And you get my new book. You could draw in 30 seconds. Put a dot out here. Now watch. I'm going to go out here. I'm going to draw the four shortened shape, and I'm going to draw the layer. I'm going to do another layer. Watch, I'm going to curve the bottom. These are going to be cliff edges here. See, cliff, cliff, cliff. I go out here. I'm going to come up a little higher, not to the corner. Go, remember what we're doing. We're doing, we're repeating this, right? This edge here, this edge here. Okay, we're just going to draw the edge of it, though. So I'm going to go out. See, come in here. And then I'm going to draw this cliff. Now, right away, I know what I want to do here is I kind of, I want to, slant that in a bit here so let's go ahead and slant that in and coming down here now here see this is a problem see how inky that is that's why it's ruining my paper well i'll go like that look at this i'm going to break this off and there it is there's a brand new eraser you think that that's pretty common sense well i just realized that about two months ago and all these years i've been using these erasers that you can clean it up if it starts leaving inky problems like up hip, up there all right slant it in there we go all right so let's start up here i'm gonna have this is gonna be a cool one we're gonna fill this whole page now i'm gonna draw this kind of rocky mountain ledge and then i'm gonna put a thickness inside this door hey sue how you doing hey fidel trevino how are you doing i'm gonna go through and wave to everybody i'm gonna wave i'm gonna wave here I'm going to go down here. There's Scott. There's Brian. I'm going to wave to Brian. Are you still there? Hey, guys. There's John James Hunt. Hi, John James Hunt. Hey, Benedict. How you doing? Hey, Anna C. MC. I'm going to wave to you. I'm going to wave to everybody here. There's Benedict. Wave to you. And uh, there's Rodney. Hi, Rodney. There's Jake. I'm going to wave to Jake. All right. Let's, hi, Karen. All right. Let's go all the way down here. Now, I'm going to draw the, the uh, dinosaur's butt, and it's going to hit this tail, then. It's going to come out. Here's his tail. And the tail's going to be coming down in direction south. See this? The tail's coming down in direction south, west. Missing getting to watch you on TV here. Oh, thanks there, Mr. John James Hunt. Well, hey, uh, you know, in Michigan, I'm coming. I'm doing a summer camp in Grand Rapids this summer, a full week in Grand. Well, it's four days, not a full week. It's four days, but um, it's an hour, or two hours, or three hours a day, depending on what you want to sign your kids up for. And it's at the in Grand Rapids. That's at the Story, uh, the the Dog's Breath Story Theater. Isn't that funny? That name here. Look at the the the, the tail hits here and it slants down. If I draw in 30 seconds, I'm trying to see. Let's see here. If I... Hi, Janet. How are you from San Diego? No, no, I'm sorry. In Nuts Berry Farm. What, what would I do with the other half of my minute? Ha, ha, ha. That's funny, Scott. That's funny, Mr. Heckler. I love that you guys are heckling me. Uh, you've been following me since you were nine years old. Wow, that's wonderful. It's 126. Well, you guys, and don't... don't uh, I don't have to stay up too late. You can always watch this. It'll be posted. It'll be there forever, you guys. But I do love the feedback. Sorry it's so late in Texas. Oh, my. Oh, he told me. Look at this. You guys, stop talking about how late it is. I'm going to start yawning. I want to draw this picture with you. This is a dinosaur's tail grouping over the edge. Look at that. Isn't that fun? This was in one of my books. I don't remember which one. I think it was one of my... Uh, draw, draw, draw series. Uh, Janet's visit her parents in Arizona. Well, hello, Janet's parents. Josh Schmosh, you have the coolest name yet. The coolest name yet. 
to mankind is Josh Mosh. Josh Mosh. Okay, here, here, let's go up here. Let's draw the thickness. I'm going to put, maybe I'll put a couple rocks right here. Maybe I'll put a boulder, a little rock over here on the edge. And then there's placement, see? And then now, over, well, coming over here, look, I'm going to put some grass. Now watch this. I'm going to droop the grass. I've always loved doing this. Let's, let's droop the grass. Let's droop some grass here, especially over by the rocks. Okay? And then I'm going to darken in this back. Oh, look at contour. Now right here is to think of a tube. See this? Think of a tube curving back here. Curve, curve these lines even more than you think you have to. Okay, as it goes in here. And then we're going to darken it behind. That's called contrast. Uh, 227 a.m. for Karen Wall. You guys, you're talking about me getting some sleep. Goodness, what are you guys doing up so late? I'm a Takawaka, and I had a student named Luke Skywalker. Wow, Janet. <laughs> Scott Kistler kicked some butt, too. Well, thank you. Yeah, well, everybody, when I was in... Uh, when I was in junior high, everybody called me Mark Muller. Mark kissed her, kissed her, right? Mwah, mwah, kiss. And I just, I was, just, oh, I was so, you know, annoyed by it. Now, in high school, I thought that was pretty cool. I was like, yeah, cool. I'm a Mr. Cool guy. The girls love me. Here, curve this here. And, of course, I was hoping that. Here, let's curve here, curve here, contour, contour. Look at this. See the curves? See the curves? This is curving. This is like a tube. Think of a tube. His brother was Indiana Jones. Well, Janet, those are some very interesting parents who named their kids the uh, Luke Skywalker and Indiana Jones. I want to meet them. I want to. I want to hang out with those guys. I want to have a. I want to have a, a chicken pot by dinner with those guys. So let's see how that evening goes. Here, put the shadow. Put the shadow underneath here. See this? Okay, let's put the next layer. Okay, next layer here. We're putting, I love the shadow. We're gonna do a lot of blending here. And then look at, think of a tube, think of a tube. They were a tube, think of a tube. You can put bumps down here on the, on the dragon's tail. You can put spots, spots are kind of fun. Put some spots on the on the drag. Look, I'll put a groups. I'll put little groups of spots here. Not too many, not too few. And see, I'll put some single. I like to see the spots. That fine. And then I'm gonna shade. I get a lot of hearts. Thank you. Who's giving me all those hearts? I love you too. Whoever's giving me the hearts, thanks a lot. All right, uh, you know, I'm put a shadow down here, the shadow that lift that up, the shadow down here. Oh, there's some amazing costumes here at this Comic Con, at Emerald City Reed Pop Comic Con, I tell you. I'm really going to try to get there early tomorrow so I can webcast live from one of these Emerald City Comic Cons tomorrow. Oh. But I'm going to get a good night's sleep tonight. i got to get there early tomorrow. Apparently, instead of opening at 10, they're going to open at 9.30, which is cool. I'll do it. I'm going to put some more boulders over here, some more rock, little groups. See, group, group the rocks together and make some rocks. See, if some rocks come, come out here, see? See, put little groups of them around here. And then, you know what? I think you could, if you want, put a like a little window and have like this little guy looking out. He's looking out here. Always, I always have time to put a, put a cool, crazy window. I'm going to shade it. I'm just scribbling right now. I'll use my stompy if I could. Oh, but good. I bought it. I was wondering if I had it. I brought my stompy. Do you guys have your stompy? And then put the shadow. So this is this this is actually a lesson that I did in one of my in one of my books. I can't remember which one it is. You guys remember? I think it was in one of the draw 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 books. It's on Amazon uh, dot com. Amazon books. Uh, 
type in my name. I look for one of the draw, draw, draws, and it's in, I think it's in uh, Gadgets and Gizmos, or it's in uh, uh, cre cre Creatures and Critters. I'm not sure. How are your room? Okay. Oh, they're, they're wonderful. I'm at the Hyatt. Of course they're wonderful. They're awesome. And shade down here. Shade down here. And they have really good coffee in the morning, which is nice. And they actually, when I go down to the cafe, when I'm going over to the Comic-Con, um, I usually go to a 7-Eleven so I can get, a, uh, or a Subway sandwich or a 7-Eleven so I can get, you know, like a sandwich and some waters and stuff and, you know, granola bars so I don't have to eat uh, the convention food. Most of the time the convention food isn't really that all that uh, good for me. Uh, but the convention food here looks really good. And the, my favorite hot dog place on the planet is across the street, a little cart. It's run by this just the nicest lady. I've met her three years in a row, uh, and she uh, she seems like she gets younger every year. She, she looks like she's like 28, and she's this hot dog entrepreneur. Um, just really cool. She has good hot dogs. All right, so look at there is our thing now. Uh, so, by the, but I was telling about the hotel lobby. They have this uh, cafe, and they and so I was able to buy chicken sandwiches to take with it to today's because I don't have an opportunity at all during the day to get any food because it's just so wonderfully, wonderfully, wonderfully busy. So I just bring a little packed lunch, right? Bring a sandwich and a little fruit cup and some veggies. And uh, it was really good. It was a really good sandwich. Of course, then I get mustard and mayonnaise all over my mustache and I need people to say, oh, God. Uh, Sir, thank you. Nice to see you. By the way, you have stuff all over your face. So thank you for you, your honesty. Here, shade down here. There's nothing like trying to eat lunch and not look like really, really obnoxious when you're sitting in your, your my artist table, you know? Shade down here. I'm blending it, guys. Now, the key for when you're using this uh, stomp is you don't want to... Uh, Make it muddy. You don't want to. You want to keep the different uh, graded values. Does that make sense? You don't want to make all of the. Oh, thanks, there's Mr. Scott. Uh, okay, so now you know what I'm going to do for this one, for our 90 days. 90 days. It. I'm going to draw the. Uh oh, I, I had someone knock on the wall in the hotel and I used to have a neighbor's. Maybe, I'm, am I talking that loud? Because I can't remember, I'm deaf, I don't have my hearing aids in, so. Um, oh, I was gonna put like, uh, the, the you know, the rubble and stuff, the, the grass hanging down here. And then, you know what I'm gonna do here? I'm gonna draw like a, I'm gonna draw the tail. Oh, this will be cool, here, this is cool. I'm gonna draw the tail that's looping up here, and then it's gonna come up and come droop out of this. Okay, that'll be cool, and then we'll draw the dinosaur's butt. So it comes down, hits here, and you can see, maybe see the back of his foot or something over here. This is like a separate picture, right? I'll, and I'll, and I'll put the shadow coming down here. It hits the... Does that make sense, you guys? Do you like it? 90 days. 90 drawings. Okay, I gotta move this out of the way a little bit so I can get in here. Uh, Janet, I know I said but, oops. <laughs> I forget, Turbo G, the dinosaurs, Badushi, the dinosaurs, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Oh, by the way, Janet, that's very mature of you to point out that I said but. <laughs> I'm sure your kids in your class point out right away, right? Oh, I had so much fun at your school, Janet. Your kids were so engaged. They were so 
just right on task. They laughed and got loud and they got quiet. They were great. I just love that, you know, when you're in the zone. All right. Here we go, draw that. And they're just gonna shade it here. There's my table number. Maybe they should probably do some Secret City. Sure. You guys want to do it? We'll do it tomorrow. We'll do Secret City theme tomorrow. Let's do it. We'll do a Secret City tomorrow. That would be fun. With some Unibears and stuff. Sure. Why not? All right. Now, this one is going to say 90 days, 90 drawings. And... I sure like how they do that. There, there's our goal. I sure like how Chad Wheeling started us doing the tabs in there like that. It's, it's cool. All right. So now I'll use my Stompy. And I want to give the whole 90 a value. See that? I give the whole 9 a value. There we go. Uh, no, I haven't found a home for the Secret City mural. It's still up safe in the rafters of my brother's classroom. Um, if anybody knows a museum who who uh, wants it, I'm kind of backing off on it because I'm thinking of uh, putting it in my own home. But uh, but I don't I don't even know what I would sell it for really because it's it's really priceless. It's a piece of American history, right, of that, you know, pop culture, 1980s television, it's cool, um, and it's just neat, you know, I mean, I drew it, so, of course, I, I have an affinity for it, all right, there you go, do you like it, all right, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to draw, how about the Museum of Pop Culture, well, how about it, give, give uh, that would be wonderful, I, I would, I'd love to, have a museum, uh, have it for, have it for a, a while, maybe for a year or two. That'd be great. They can, they can pay the $5,000. It won't be 5000 but they pay the shipping. I'd be happy to. All right, listen, I'm going to sign my name, you guys, and put the, the date. It's day, uh, Mark Kistler, days. What did you say, Karen, 74? Hey, Rosley. Seven, day 74, I think, was Karen says. She's our, our director, our manager, day 74. All right, well, there you go. I'll, po I'll post that on Instagram, guys. And uh, thank you, everybody, for drawing with me. You guys are awesome. You're, fa you're my favorite. I love you. Take care of each other. And I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you, Karen. Bye, everybody.